And this year, South Korea designated August 14th as a memorial day for the victims of Japan's horrific wartime system of sex slavery. And for the month of October, a powerful art exhibition is being held right here in Seoul. Our Lee min Sun went to check it out and filed this report. A local artist put together over 100 pencil drawings, which resulted from the stories told by four victims of Japan's wartime sex slavery, also known as Comfort Woman. The Seoul government and the Northeast Asian History Foundation jointly opened an art drawing exhibition titled Comfort Woman Stories Through Art in the basement of Seoul's Citizens Hall in the center of the capital city. Because they haven't spoke or expressed their pain publicly, they had difficulties trying to express themselves through drawing, but soon after, they initiated talks and drew what they experienced without my instructions. Through these 130 pieces of drawings, the artist hopes that viewers will come to understand Comfort Woman's courage in trying to heal from the wartime atrocities. Seoul Mayor Park Won-sun said that these efforts to remember tragic history are important as they help to prevent the same pain from happening ever again. Some of the drawings depict the moment the victims were taken away from their families as teenagers and how they were violated by Japanese soldiers. My parents taught me a lot about comfort women, but seeing the drawings myself gives me more to think about. I hope Japan apologizes before all the comfort women pass away. After looking at the art, visitors can write messages of hope and support for the victims and hang them on a tree to make it seem like it is blossoming. This pencil drawing art portraying stories of comfort women will be on display till end of October and is open to the public for free. Imin Sun, Arirang News.